The following video may not be suitable for children 13 and under. Viewer discretion is advised. Hey everyone, welcome to the channel, Inu Tabi here. Today we're going to take a look at my favorite Dinobot, Swoop, from Legacy Evolution. It's core class. Uh, he's the only one I bought out of the Dinobots. Maybe I'll get the others. Maybe I'll build uh, whatever the freaking combiner is called. Volatis? What is the freaking name? I can't think of a name. Anyway, this is the, this is the guy that is my favorite Dinobot. I got him in Masterpiece from Vans Toys. Uh, I got him coming in Legends. Got him here. I wouldn't mind having a G1 version at some point. Um, you know, I always liked him better than the other ones, but we'll see. Volcanicus. There we go. <laughs> we're going to build him or not. But this is Core Class. Uh, nice little artwork here on this. Before we get too far in this video, if you're watching this, uh, you like Transformers, you like G.I. Joe, you like Moto, you like anything. Oh, six steps. All right. Uh, just hit that subscribe button. Really would help out the channel. So uh, the gold is really popping here. We'll, we'll go into that. We've got some nice artwork here on the side. We've got Swoop running here with a blaster. Got him in bird mode. We've got the artwork here for Legacy Evolution. We're going into United now. So this is number five of six. I don't know. Put in the comments. Should I get the other ones? Should I build the freaking robot? I know it looks terrible, but uh, I don't know. Maybe maybe I ought to get him. I don't know. Put that in the comments. Let me know. What do you think? Uh, Dinobot Swoop. That's pretty much it. Not much to these core class. I do like the core class. Uh, they're fairly cheap. I got this for nine bucks or whatever. And uh, they sit on the shelf. You put them with the Ark and some of the big bots. They look okay. It's, it's nothing. Some are better than the others. I think the, uh, the Master Force ones, the Pretenders or whatever they did, were really good. Uh, Seeker's been pretty good. And uh, yeah, so there it is. All right, let's get out of the box, take a look at it. All right, it comes with these pieces here. Um, kind of look like hands, weapons. You can plug into to his wings here, I think. We've got some tabs, some slots. You can plug them in. Kind of don't like the black, but it would have been nice if it was like blue and Kind of look like it's original weapons, but you can plug it in like that. And where is the other one? Oh, right here. He uh, he looks good in the packaging. You get him out of the packaging, he's okay, I guess. He's he's just swoop doing swoop, I guess. It's uh, let's see if we can get this to tab on. I'm trying to do it on camera. There we go. So you can do that in the weapon, the wings. It's not much to it. This gray kind of looks bad. I wish that was painted silver. I mean gold. Um, it looks pretty good from the front. Head sculpt's nice. I mean, wings fold out. You can fold the wings back if you want to do it like that as well. That's optional. The back of him, he's hollow as, as hollow as your Halloween pumpkin. I mean, that is bad right there. But, I mean, you know, nicely detailed. Ball joint on there. He can look, he can look a lot up. And that's good because you got him in the bird mode. Uh, you want that. The wings fold back. The arms will go up on the ball joint here. They'll rotate around. He's very tight. Ball joint here on this arm. Uh, we got a, a waist rotation. That is limited because the nose of the bird. Uh, leg will go up and kind of off to the side, but not much up straight because the bird nose. But you can fold the bird nose up. Uh, you, know, you can fully rotate it at the waist too. Or, there you go. Once you get the bird nose up. But, here you go up, and then you do that. So that's nice. Nice gold paint. The Autobot symbol looks good. Blue on the bird uh, head. I'm just calling it the bird. It's pterodactyl or whatever it's supposed to call. Uh, nice details, though. Nice red stripe right there. The wings being, you know, it would have kind of been nice if they were like chrome. Maybe I'll paint these chrome. Uh, you know, I don't think that would look too bad. This is definitely needs to be gold. But uh, here's the back of them. And he does form Volcanicus. There you go. I got the name now. Uh, Volcanicus to form a bigger body. I don't. I don't know, man. I don't know. Put it in the comments. Should I get it? Should I? Should I try to build that thing? I don't. I don't know. 
know, it feels like it's a mistake, but there it is. Looks pretty good. Like I said, my favorite Dinobot. We'll just set him on the shelf. Uh, let's transform him into Dino Flying Bird mode and go with that. See what it looks like. But, uh, I, you know, I don't think he looks too bad. He looks better than some of the other ones. I think Star will look pretty good. But, uh, yeah, the, the silver on the face, blue eyes, that looks fine. And I definitely like the blue here on the chest, so pretty nice. All right, let's go through and transform it into uh, Dino mode. Dino mode's actually very easy. Just hold his head back like this, so it looks straight up. Old bird mode like that. Take and tab the two legs together. Just uh, plug in notch right there. Go ahead and fold the wings up here. Fold the legs over. They're going to go in these two slots like that. You already got the guns plugged in. Uh, the hands right here have got a little tab on the side of the thighs. Plug that in. And you're basically done. There's Swoop. Uh, you know, it's okay. The ball joints exposed like that looks bad, but I mean, you're talking about a, a $9.99 figure. So I don't, you know, I think the paint looks nice. I do really wish these wings were like chrome and there was some more paint here on this, but for this price point, what you're dealing with, I, you know, I think it is kind of, kind of limited. You know, I would really do some custom work on this, like some painting and stuff like that. If I was going to do it, do the set because... I mean, I don't know. I think a swoop needs a lot more going on, but I don't think it looks too bad. Let's see. Can we do... I don't know. Let's just see. Okay. You can do blast effect, so it's optional there. So th that's nice. You can do that point, so you can have them blasting, flying through. So not bad. There it is. And that's swoop. And it's core class Transformers Legacy Evolution. So... Check them out if you're interested. My favorite Dinobot. That's the only reason I picked them up. Thanks for watching the video, guys. I do appreciate it. Like I said, if you're watching this, you're watching the channel, hit that subscribe button. Help out the channel. Thanks for watching. See you later.